Good morning and welcome to Hoddle Round. Today we are going to be testing the Radeon RX Vega 64. This one's made by PowerColor. And we're going to try the same settings as the first video. Um, and now we have a kilowatt meter. GPU core set at 1400. The memory set at 945. The power limit is at negative 30 right now. And I will change the fans in a second uh, to about 2900 RPM. Uh, this is Poe. This is a mine pet. He loves the heat, whether it be from gaming or mining. Oh, don't get too close, buddy. But at idle, we are looking at 40 to 50 watts. And after we get the readings on this, we're going to try the settings from Jack Good and see if we can get that 43 mega hash. And this is Claymore 9.8. And we are on Ubic, or Ubiqu, however you want to say it. See the tack is lighting up. All right, so there it is. We have the same hash rate as yesterday, so 37. And I'm just clicking the S button for status. And we will check the meter. So it looks like we're about 250 watts. So we're about 200 watts for the Vega at 37 mega hash. And now we're going to try the other settings. We're going to set the GPU at 1000 on this last state. Memory at 1100. And he said power limit to 24. So we'll try that. All right, so I'm just hitting status again. So that's 43.4 mega hash, 43.6, dropped a little bit. So around 43, uh, we're starting to get pretty even bars. So I like whenever the GPU clocks are stable and we'll go check the watt meter. Wow, so 218 watts. 225 so that's about 175 watts for 43 mega hash which is pretty awesome I think on a 1070 you're looking at about anywhere from 110 to 125 watts for 31 mega hashes All right, so as you can see, 43.6 mega hash at 175 watts. And we're using the settings from Jack Good. He posted a comment on our video. And just an update, these are the newest drivers available. So let me see if I can find that for you. So Radeon software. 17.8.2 So I will keep you guys updated it looks like as they release more software for the Vega The hash rate will get better and the power usage will drop 